<coughs> due shore, Laporte still seeing some pretty heavy rain down into Benton and the Bloomsburg area. But I do think that severe threat has come to an end uh, west of the Scranton, Wilkesbury area, even farther west in parts of Clinton County, just dealing with some light rain showers. Similar story in Lycoming County. So again, the front moving in from the west to the east, tape tapering off from the west to the east as well. But we are on the air for that tornado warning that that severe thunderstorm warning capable of producing the tornado was located right over Lackawaxen about 10 or so minutes ago, about uh, 14 miles east of Honesdale, moving north at 35 miles an hour. So the uh, actual severe storm, the severe warned storm that was over Lackawaxen now really just to the north of Lackawaxen, so to the north of Pike County. This is radar indicated and we can go over some, of course, some safety tips. If you are in this area, if you know someone in this area, after, again, a dry first half of the day, warm first half of the day, definitely want to make sure you are informing anybody you know who is in this area. But, of course, here are some safety tips. Heading for the lowest level of your home, basement would be best. It's the safest place to be, but, of course, the lowest level of your home and getting as many walls between you and the outdoors as possible. If you don't have the basement, again, getting to the lowest level, but getting under a table can help. Protecting your head with a helmet or covering, your, covering up with under a table, something like that. And of course, turning up your TV. If you are able to watch us on TV, if you haven't lost power, because even where we're not seeing that tornado warning, we are still seeing some gusty winds, and we've seen gusty winds for the last several hours ahead of the front. So the good news is behind the front, we will definitely start to see those winds diminishing tonight and overnight, but it's ahead of the front that we've had gusty winds over 60 miles an hour, and this severe worn storm, of course, over Lackawaxen even higher than that. And that was radar-indicated rotation, which is why this uh, tornado warning was issued by the National Weather Service just a little while ago. So radar indicated rotation, as well as quarter size hail and really just some heavy rain associated with that storm that's right over Lackawaxen. You can see now moving to the north of Lackawaxen, this tornado warning remaining in effect for a little bit longer, but again, the severe threat moving north of our area, but behind it still those severe thunderstorm warnings. So I do wanna focus on the line of storms that's in parts of Wayne County now, so the eastern part of Susquehanna County as well, Starocka, Pleasant Mount, Forest City, you can see that heavy rain, frequent lightning. We also have some small hail associated with that line, the northern part of Lackawanna County as well. So getting ready to move into the Honesdale area, southern part of Wayne County seeing that line of storms with frequent lightning associated with it. So if you are hearing thunder, Definitely make sure you are getting inside. Zooming out a little bit. So there it is. So this is, again, the front that continues to move from the west to the east. So it's really just to the east of the Scranton area where we are seeing that severe threat. But behind it, that severe threat coming to an end. So in central Pennsylvania, while we are still dealing with some periods of some of that steadier and heavier rain, the severe threat is over, I, I would say, in central Pennsylvania, just dealing with rain showers through the rest of the evening. Now, I do want to toss it over to uh, Lisa just to give me a break and look at some things here. If we do have Lisa on the desk. <laughs> Thank you. Well, and that's the thing. So obviously tornado warnings is why we come on the air and stay on the air, but severe thunderstorm warnings with gusty winds over 60, uh, 70 miles an hour, even if they're straight line winds, even if there's not rotation within those winds, it's still definitely a concern and, and just lightning. After a day of that's been dry all day long, some sunshine here in the Scranton area, temperatures in the 70s, lots of people outside this time of year. So of course, even if it's not a tornado warning, it's still, very important to to get inside and, and take protect take precautions. Yeah. 
it, so yes, yeah, so no warnings in central Pennsylvania. We saw that rain earlier in the day in central Pennsylvania. Still seeing some rain shower activity, but the steadiest and heaviest rain in central Pennsylvania is starting to taper off, coming to an end. So that severe threat for central Pennsylvania has ended. Now it's really farther east that we're concerned with. So we'll get to show you radar. So it is parts of the Poconos, parts of Lackawanna, Wayne counties, still seeing those severe thunderstorm warnings, which like I mentioned, gusty winds over 60, 70 miles an hour, even if it's not a tornado warning, still a concern. So the area shaded in yellow, those are the severe thunderstorm warnings that we have. So the Honesdale area, Wayne County, all of Wayne County seeing that severe thunderstorm warning until seven o'clock and then the rest of Pike County also seeing that severe thunderstorm warning until seven o'clock. So show you that again, the area shaded in yellow are the severe thunderstorm warnings, the area in red, which is why we are uh, going to continue to stay on the air even after 630. That's that tornado warning. So it was a severe warned storm right over Lackawaxen that was capable of producing the tornado. There was some radar indicated rotation right over Lackawaxen and that is why that tornado warning was issued. So because now that was about at 610 that that was issued, the, I think the rotation is now to the north of the Lackawaxen area, but behind it, we are still seeing, again, some really heavy rain in parts of Pike County, southern part of Wayne County, getting ready to enter the Honesdale area, some heavy rain, some gusty winds, as well as some frequent lightning. So even after that tornado warning, expires, we do still have that line that continues to move into Wayne County, Pike County, a little bit farther south. You can see just to this right, really right over the Stroudsburg area, still some lightning and some heavy rain associated with that. So even after that tornado warning expires at 645 or maybe even before then for the Pike County area, as it continues to move north, we do still have that line behind it. So right over Pleasant Mount again, down into Forest City, getting ready to enter, enter the Honesdale area. So the southern part of Wayne County, really seeing that heaviest rain currently. That severe threat to the east of the Scranton and Wilkesbury area right now, we will still have rain for the next several hours, but that severe threat has come to an end in the Scranton Wilkesbury area and to the west of the Scranton and Wilkesbury area, excuse me. And then through much of central Pennsylvania, again, a similar story. While we do still have some rain and we will still have some rain for the next couple of hours, the severe threat is what's entering the Wayne Pike County areas right now.